working in the Netherlands. This film is about choosing what kind of work you want to do, how to find a job and how to apply for a job. Before you can start looking for a job, you must think about what kind of work you want to do. In the Netherlands, there are many different occupations. A small number of people work in agriculture or fishing. A quarter of the population works in factories or the building industry. Most people work in the services industry, for example, in education, in hospitals, in IT, at a local council or in the waste sector. Mohammed graduated from an agricultural college in Syria, where he then worked as a beekeeper. He wanted to do the same work in the Netherlands. In 2014, I was uh, of the dike. In 2014, I was walking along the dike when I smelt a bee smoker. I thought, there's a beekeeper here. I still want to work with bees. I worked as a volunteer for a few months, then I got a contract. Work. Like Mohammed, would you like to do the same as you did in your home country? Or something different? To make the right choice, Khotra from the Dutch Council for Refugees advises people to visit workplaces. If you want to become a car mechanic, it is a good idea to meet a car mechanic in the Netherlands. Car mechanics here are totally different to those in, for example, Eritrea. You have to find out what being a car mechanic involves in the Netherlands. Or a baker. A Syrian baker is totally different to a Dutch baker. For many jobs, you need to have had training or have your diploma assessed. Once you know what kind of work you want to do and you have the right diploma, you can start looking for a job. But how do you find a job in the Netherlands? First of all, through a network, which means getting to know people. The more Dutch people you know, the larger your professional network becomes. Newcomers are looking for work, Dutch people too. But the difference is that the newcomer does not have a network, and Dutch people do. Tell everyone you are looking for a job. They may be able to help you. You can do voluntary work, a work placement, or work experience. You can do voluntary work for as long as you want to, but if you receive a benefit, you must get permission from the local council. A work placement or work experience is usually unpaid work for three to six months to gain experience. Look for a company that suits your wishes and ambitions. You will then gain experience and build a network in the field of work in which you want to do paid work. Salomon works in a metal factory. He started here in a work experience position. I did unpaid work here for three months and since then paid work. For six months I haven't had help from social services. I'm very happy. Anna also did a work placement with a graphic design company before she got a paid job. I did this because I wanted to see how things were. That is a good way to start. You understand what qualities you have and what you enjoy. Mohammed did a work placement at the same company as Hannah. He learned how software works and gained experience with the company's culture. I also got used to the atmosphere at work, how people talk to each other, how the work is done. For example, when people work, they're not very formal and make jokes. The culture differs between companies. In the Netherlands, you can always ask someone if there is anything you don't know or understand, even your boss. In Onslaan, uh, the boss altijd boss. In our country, the boss is always stern when people ask him something. It's different here. You must ask questions, talk to the boss. You must communicate well with the boss. At first, this was difficult for me. But now it isn't. Things are fine.
Another way of finding work is by registering with an employment agency. This agency will try to find a temporary job for you. There are, of course, also many different job sites on the Internet. You know what kind of work you want to do and you have found a vacancy for a work placement, work experience or a job. The next step is to apply for it and present yourself well. Shosh, the director of a graphic design company, explains what is important during a job interview. We want to see that someone really wants it, that he is eager. Try to explain your passion. When you talk about something you really like, people will feel this. I have learned to present myself in very short sentences. You should say what you have done and what your goal is. For example, I'm Mohamed Gohani and I want to be a graphic designer. I would love to do a work placement here to build my portfolio. That's my goal. I advise people, the newcomers, to do voluntary work, a work placement, just like me. Contact people. Don't stay at home. You could, of course, also start your own business. It's best to ask another business owner or the Chamber of Commerce how to do this in the Netherlands. If you have any questions about work, see your customer manager at the local council or your coach at the Dutch Council for Refugees.